Hey there, my name is Amy Batchelor with Lodestar SEO. I spoke to a very sweet lady on the phone yesterday who said I could shoot this video over to you. I'm a local business owner just like yourself and know that COVID has really hurt some businesses. So I just wanted to give back and show you what you can do in order to compete online with your competitors and drive more traffic to your business. I wanted to jump on here real quick and go ahead and go through your site and show you kind of what we think is going to be best for you. So I'm going to jump in and start going through what we see and where we think you can get the most value. I'm pretty much going to explain to you three things that you can do today to really bring value to your company and start outranking your competitors online, okay? The very first thing I want to go over is your website and what we call content. Now when someone searches for air duct cleaning Houston, say, Google crawls websites on the internet searching and ranking the sites. It's looking for keywords, it's looking for what should this site be found for? So when I go through here, I see you have some nice photos on your site and a beautiful layout. I see a lot of content. And one thing I can tell you about Google is Google loves content. So Google likes to see a minimum of 1,500 words on your front page. And we're looking at right now with your site is we're probably sitting at over 2,200 words on this page. Now you wanna make sure that you have keywords that people search for on your site. And you have the words air duct cleaning on this page 37 times. Now, Google calls this keyword stuffing and will dock you for it. So you wanna minimize that word phrase. Then we can go over to a photo. So let's just take this one and we're gonna see how it's saved. You see how your image is saved up here? WhatsApp image 2020-04-23? Okay, so you're gonna to wanna to save these images on your website as keywords all right so we'll talk a little bit more about keywords here in a second but not only does Google look at your site but when Google comes into your site they can't tell what they should be ranking you for if you don't have any keyword specific things on here so what does that mean well let's look at your competitor so when I looked up air duct cleaning Houston these guys came up and when we start scrolling through their website we see content here pictures and they have about 1800 words on here they've saved their key their their images as keywords and I could just show you a quick little sample of that see how they have it saved air duct cleaning Houston that is what I'm talking about whenever I say to save those images as keywords okay so what does all this mean well this right here is a tool I use called RFs. It allows me to see every keyword you're ranking for, how much traffic you get into your site. Now we can see here that you're getting found for 313 keywords and you're getting 73 people a month to your website. So when we jump in here and look at your competitor, you see this one right here is you. There's airqualitytech.com. And now I'm going to jump over to the competitor, takeair.com right here. So when we jump in here, they're getting found for 396 or 98 keywords, 96 keywords, right? They're getting 116 people a month to their site. And we would go in and we look at their keywords. We can just look at a couple here that I can show you. Houston Air Duct Cleaning Services. They're getting 80 clicks a month on that keyword alone. And they're sitting on the first page of Google for that one. Another good one that I could show you. Let's see, air duct cleaning, here we go, dryer vent, let's do this one, dryer vent cleaning Houston, 350 clicks a month for that keyword that they're getting found for. So once we do the first thing of getting the right content on your site and getting the right keywords on your site, the next thing to do is go and find what we call backlinks, okay? So what are backlinks? Backlinks are pretty much, let's say, another air duct cleaning site from Houston, Spring, or even Florida. It just needs to be in your kind of field, air duct cleaning. Linking back to your site, saying that you're the most popular one here. So the way that Google works, it's like a popularity contest back in high school, right? The more sites we get linking into your site, the more popular it tells Google that you are, and the more they want to rank you for these keywords. So we need to go out, 
look at your competitors, we see that they have 482 referring domains linking back to their site. So we have to beat it. And not all backlinks are created equal, right? So like getting a link from Starbucks linking to you is not going to be as powerful as a general contractor or something like that linking back to you. To tell Google that you're relevant, you're in the right niche, and you're popular. That's what we want to go after, okay? So we have about 482 referring domains. Now, we don't want to get the same amount as them when it comes to links. We want to beat them by 20, 30 links to really start beating out the competition, to outrank them, to take that traffic. And then last but not least, I want to talk to you about the third thing we want to go get, and that's what we call citations. Now, I'm sure that you've heard of the map pack before. So this is the map pack right here, right? And you see I Googled air duct cleaning Houston. So here's your map pack. And then directly below your map pack is going to be your organic. Now I found you on the second page since you're currently running an ad. And I'll just show you where I found you. I'm going to go to the second page. And here you are right here. Okay. So I'm going to click back over to the first page. Now to get to this organic, first page of organic, we got to get those keywords up. We got to get all the links coming into your site. And to get into this map pack right here, we have to go after what we call citations. And a citation is your name, address, and phone number throughout the web on as many directories as possible. And a directory is like Yelp. Yext, CityStar, and all those directories that are out there, we want to get your business listed on them. It tells Google that you're legit. So we go over here to another resource I use called whitespark.ca. I did a report and I found the top listing on MatPax and it looks like he has 99, see this take air? He has 99 citations. And here's you, Air Quality Express. You're sitting at right now at 14 citations, okay? So when we pull up this map pack and we click on more businesses for Air Duct Cleaning Houston, you're found on the second page. I'm just going to go ahead and show you. Uh, let's see. Click over to the second page. And we're going to find you right here. So here you are. I'm going to go right back over to the first page. Now our goal is to be right here. We want to be on the first we want to be on the first page, not only the first page, but we want to be on the top three. Because if you think about it, when someone Googles on their phone, they're looking for an air duct cleaner, they're going to click on those top ones. They're going to, they're not going to go page by page and search and search and search, right? Unless they actually are looking for you, right? So you want to make sure that we get you on the top three position. So once again, we went over content. We got to get the content on your site. You've got a beautiful looking site, but we got to get the keyword relevant content. And then once we have that, we want to go out and we want to get these backlinks, right? We need to get your backlinks up to start driving traffic to where you're getting over, over a hundred people a month to your site. And once we have that, we want to come over here and we want to get these citations so we can go after all those citations that they have so these are the three things I think have implemented today it's really going to get you found on Google and drive more customers to your business I've shown you uh, I've only shown you one competitor and one keyword search there are dozens of buyer intent keywords for the air duct industry that we could capture the traffic of thousands of clicks per month that you aren't getting all right so thank you for taking the time to listen to me today. Like I said earlier, my name is Amy. And if you like what you've seen here today and you want to chat, you can pull up lodestarseo.com. You can reach me for my contact info. So thank you so much for hearing me out and you have a great day.